I noticed that I was having trouble hearing in meetings, for example, and uh, some people have loud voices and that's okay, but some people have very soft voices and I would find myself leaning forward or straining or saying, I beg your pardon, I didn't hear that. Or... And also my family got sick of me saying, I didn't hear that. Sorry, could you say that again? And so I came to Ear and Hearing Australia and um, it was a wonderful result. Well, of course, I had no idea what the process would be when I came along to have my hearing tested. Um, but the, the process was straightforward, simple, easily. It was explained very well to me. And um, I had the test and the audiologist um, told me that I had moderate to severe hearing loss, which in a peculiar kind of way cheered me up. <laughs> I wasn't imagining it. And um, we took it from there. And the patience and the attention to detail and the, any silly question easily and quickly answered and supported me. I, I can't tell you, Ear and Hearing Australia were terrific. Um, having the hearing aids has made a huge difference to me. Um, I'm not, it, I don't feel so tired and stressed when I'm in social situations because I was always trying to concentrate so hard and, you know, listen. Um, the, it's amazing that technology, that you can, it can be so personalised and um, adjusted. And one of the wonderful um, features of coming to Ear and Hearing Australia is that the time and the uh, patients they are the audiologists um, have adjusting the hearing aids for your particular um, requirements and what you want to do with them and you know silly things like the telephone and stuff that that is an amazing feature that's the one I like the best <laughs> so yeah well, because I have the Bluetooth device, um, I'm able to use that to uh, answer my telephone and hear clearly. I love it with the television because I can sit with my family and have the television at a normal um, volume. And I enjoy that very much. It's, it's, it's a funny thing to say, but it's having the hearing aids has taken a lot of stress out of my life because I'm not always trying to concentrate and it's just made a big difference, very big difference. If you suspect you have a hearing loss, I think you should definitely get it checked out. Um, go and see an audiologist because if it could be something really simple. It could mean that you do need hearing aids, but that just be open and and to the suggestion that you may have hearing loss and let a professional have tested and uh, see how what the situation really is. And I, I really encourage you to go and see in my case, Ear and Hearing Australia, and I couldn't be happier with the service that I received. I'd certainly recommend Ear and Hearing Australia to anyone who suspects that they may have some kind of hearing loss. Uh, the professionalism, the care, the um, making it so easy to come back and have adjustments as often as you want. It's a, a great service and, and I'd encourage people to have their hearing tested at Ear and Hearing Australia if they suspect they might have some kind of hearing loss. And one of the most interesting things that I discovered is that it was a case of if you don't use it, you lose it. Uh, you actually can lose the ability to hear if you're not hearing well.